All right, here we go. Turn number one. Out of chaos rode worlds populated with multitudes of beings. Wars were fought. Kings and emperors rose and fell and civilizations were built and crumbled as millennia pass. Gods, dark and strange, were worshipped in pagan temples. Still, there was chaos. The gods fought among themselves, bringing ever greater ruin to those who would serve them. At last, there was one, a being of great power and enlightenment who rose above his immortal peers and cast them out of the heavens into oblivion. Lucid, I'm doing a thing! From chaos came order, and with order came peace. And the creatures of the worlds flourished. The age of chaos had ended. Now the wheel has turned once again. The supreme god has suddenly disappeared. Prayers are left unanswered, and the smoke of offerings rises in vain to the heavens. No one knows why he disappeared, but it is certain that the people of the worlds are once again left without direction, without guiding principle, without order. Now is the time for the beings of great power and ambition to try their strength. The throne of the heavens stands empty, and only the strongest can rise to supremacy over all. Only the most powerful can ascend to take the place of he who came before. This is a time of great strife and suffering. This is a time of magic unequaled. This is the Ascension Wars. Anyway, so we're going to do this thing. This is a worse start, much worse start. I had a much better start previously. This sucks. But okay. Uh, yeah, we had to restart the game because um, uh, of a recording issue that somebody, who um, I will not name, um, but it was Lucid Tactics, um, he had a mistake. So I'm going to be getting a Chrome uh, so that we can get some sight searching going, and I'm going to get these guys just to bulk up my army a little bit. Um, I'm probably not going to be able to take any provinces turn one. Ah, oh, this is such a worse start than it was before. Ah, oh, jeez, Alu. All right, well. Um, now let's set up our stuff here. Ooh, this is pretty good, though. So we're going to go ahead and rush Conjuration 3 for sure. Then we're going to go to Construction 2, maybe? I think Construction 2 would be solid. And then we might do Enchantment or something. At that point, we're just going to have to find out. But definitely Thaumaturgy 1 is going to be important. And, uh, yeah, it looks like everybody's doing a thing. So, Harold, I feel like that's a strong name. Arthur, also quality. Um, and, yeah, I feel like everybody's good to go, so... I'm curious. No, they cost the same amount of gold. Okay. No problem. Boom! Turn one done. Alright, turn two. So, yeah, interesting. He hasn't named his prophet yet. Hmm. Hmm. Foul spawns. 30 of them. Yeah, I don't really think I can take any of these guys, which is awesome. Fantastic news. <laughs> Truly great. Um. Shit. This is rough. This is a bad start, man. Um. But, yeah. We're gonna preach. <laughs> Have a terrible fucking start. <laughs> Uh, all right, yeah, I, I have a real hard time with uh, early expansion with this race. It's a real struggle, and um, mm, yep, that's how that is. So, dab nab it. I'm not really sure how good foul spawn are. I'm gonna look it up in a minute, but uh, for now, honestly, there's really not a lot I've got going on, man. I'm getting some some wardens of Avalon. Arthur's doing his thing. He's going to go try and find the enemy. And we're going to end the turn. Here we go. Turn number three. Ah, he's named his, his prophet. I guess he was summoning them. So... <sighs> the druids concern me, so I don't really want to go that way. What am I looking at here? Do we think we can take them? I think we're going to try it. So, but we're going to definitely have to be careful with this. Um, we're going to risk it for the chocolate biscuit, baby. 
Um, because that's how we rock and roll. Yep. All right. So let's go ahead and get these guys good in position. We'll do a a sparse line. We'll do a, a line formation right there. That's gonna be fine. Um, we'll do a line formation right here as well. Um, we're gonna go ahead and hold and fire there. These guys are gonna go ahead and just attack the closest. Um, this guy is gonna cast Divine Blessing and he's gonna just, uh, wait, this is Smite, right? Uh, yes. Smite these bad boys to kingdom come. Now what's she gonna do? Because she can do Tangle Vines, I know that, that's not terrible. Um, healing Touch is like terrible range, yeah. So I think, what does False Feathers do? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Aim is tempting, Tangled Vines. I think I'm gonna do Aim, and then just spam out Tangled Vines. Yeah. That's what we're gonna do. Man, I, I do not feel good about this play. But you only die once. And that's turn number three. Here we are, turn number four. So the battle happened, and we won! Let's go ahead and check out the battle, see how it went. Um, so these are our boys, let's see how this goes. So we're gonna go ahead and cast some, some aim blessing on there. So yeah, your precision went up, I guess, which is not exactly ideal. But okay, whatever. My dudes are firing away. They're chipping away a little. Okay, here come our boys. Let's see how this goes, so... Yeah. Yeah, we can already see our uh, our dudes here are starting to, to make the magic happen. Oh, nice. Yeah. Mm. Yep. Those heavily armored guys are, are tough. They're a real problem, but fortunately, um... I have mucho dudes, and they hit like trains because of their, uh... Their bonus strength. Look at that. 30 strength. <laughs> 30 damage is pretty pretty obscene. <laughs> but, yeah. And then our guys are going to run up over here. Fortunately, nobody died. Did anybody take? Um, no afflictions were taken, so that's great news. Look at this dude. Just He just walks up to him and just waves his sword and is just like, What's up? Nice. Oh, yeah. And then they're going to flee. These two dudes. Man. <laughs> he hit so hard. That's awesome. That's awesome. Yep. Um, so that was great. That actually went quite well for our boys. So, awesome. Go team, go. You're still casting spells, I guess. This is my <laughs> archers running off into oblivion. You're, you've buffed yourself out rather thoroughly. Congratulations. Um, Alright. Cool. Awesome. That worked out really well. And we didn't lose too much, so that was really great. That was a really great situation for us. Now, the next move I'm going to make is I'm going to take this guy and send him over here. And she is going to go ahead. Good old uh, Gowen? I don't know. She's going to search for some stuff. Uh, yeah. Okay. What are we looking at as far as army-wise? Yeah, I think we're going to have a substantial army after this maneuver. And we're going to be able to expand much faster. So... Arthur's gonna keep trucking along here, trying to find stuff. Um, now, as far as this goes, yeah, we're still gonna ride with this. This is good news, so. Um, places to build might be good. Here might be okay. We're gonna figure it out. We're gonna figure it out. Yeah, and I think that's gonna be the end of our turn. I don't see much else I really wanna do. Uh, nobody's idle. So, in the turn, boom. All right, here we go. On into turn number five. So yeah, we didn't have any major events transpire here. We're gonna load up our boys. Yeah. Now we should have no problem starting to take land, which is quite good. Unfortunately, uh... Wait, what? You were preaching? Son of a beast. I thought I had her on search. Oh, that sucks real bad. Um, but this is okay. Um, that was Lucid responding to the fact that I told him that this was turn number five. Um, and this is going to be the last turn. 
of this episode, so. Yeah, man, unfortunately not a lot happening here. Oh. Oh, my, my, my. By the way, let's do that real quick. My, oh, my. What have we here? That reminds me. Uh, okay, so a forester can be gotten. So we're going to start getting some scouts. Scouts are going to be important. We're going to need vision. Um, and, yeah. This is all great. Really not a lot going on here, though. I'm sorry that this turn... I'm, I know I'm moving real slow. I know I'm moving real slow, but uh, as is the way with me and my nation, I'm a slow bad player. But hopefully, um, the turnaround of whenever we get... Summon black dogs are cool, but um, once we get these... Who said he? It's going to be awesome. Um, so, yeah. We're going to get the Kusid he. I'm thinking about maybe going and getting uh, getting some wyverns. I don't think so. I think Kusiti are going to be good. And yeah, that's going to end my turn here, I think. Um, but yeah, this is a great episode. Uh, or, I mean, I don't know, I had fun. But thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.